Good Thursday morning to you. I'm meteorologist Matt Jones. I hope you enjoyed the relatively cooler conditions over the last couple of days because that scorching heat does return to our forecast. That is our big forecast headline is a return of this major heat. Record highs are possible as we head into the weekend and still no beneficial rain in sight. So those drought conditions will continue to get worse and worse across the Arklatex. Now we're talking about near record setting heat. Now today's forecast high is only around 100. We're not going to get anywhere close to records today. Tomorrow though, look at our forecast high in Shreveport. 107 the old record 110 i don't think we're quite going to make it there but it's still going to be a very very hot day now saturday's record high is 108 our forecast 107 so we could get very close to that one same story on sunday our forecast 107 the old record 108 both of those records were set in 2011 so i think we'll be very close to at least tying some record highs as we head closer to the weekend here's today's planner now it is still a comfortable start this morning so you can still take advantage of the cool conditions because we're actually going to start off in the 60s in some spots this morning but then with all that sunshine and those winds switching to more of a southerly direction today that's going to cause our temperatures to start to heat up 90 at noon, 96 by 2 p.m., and then we should break into the triple digits this afternoon. 101 in Shreveport, Mansfield 103, Natchitoches at 103, Marshall 102, Center 105, and Natchitoches up to 105. Still a little bit cooler to the north, mid-90s into Queen and Hope, but I think everyone is going to start to get a little bit uncomfortable as we head towards the afternoon. Good news, though, for today, the humidity is still going to stay very low, so we're really not going to be dealing with too much of a heat index. Notice that your heat index is really not that different than the actual air temperature, and that's just a function of the lower humidity. So again, heat index not going to be a big deal today. That will start to change, though, for Friday as our air temperatures climb and the humidity also climbs. That heat index could be getting close to dangerously high levels, maybe even some heat warnings across our area as that heat index could approach 110 as we head towards Friday afternoon. Now notice we do start to have some heat advisories creeping in from the west, mainly across our East Texas counties right now. This is going to be in effect until about 8 p.m. this evening. Uh, some of those areas could have a heat index around 105. That heat index 110 is going to be more mostly confined out there into Texas, so still not too bad today, but that will start to change by tomorrow. Our rain chances, unfortunately, looking really, really low through the weekend and into next week. A small chance of some rain, mainly to our south on Tuesday. We'll watch a disturbance moving in off the Gulf of Mexico. Could bring some rain, but again, it looks like most of that will stay just to our south, unfortunately. And look at how hot. This is just going to be awful. 107 on Friday, 107 Saturday, 107 on Sunday. The good news is with this next round of heat, I think our humidity levels will be quite a bit lower. So it's really not going to feel horrible, but it's still going to be very hot. 104 on Monday, we stay in the triple digits with mainly dry conditions all the way through next week.